What's good, everybody? And welcome back to Having a Beer Bam. Today we're going to be drinking Brooklyn Defender IPA. It's a golden IPA from Brooklyn Brewery. Um, funny story, the first craft beer I ever had was actually uh, Brooklyn Lager. And I literally bought it because nobody would drink it when it was in my refrigerator. Everybody hated the way it tasted. I liked it. And the plus side was nobody else drank it when it was in the refrigerator. So it was great. <laughs> like I have a shitload of it and nobody would touch it. That means there was always more beer for me. <laughs> well, enough of my storytelling. Let's crack this home bitch open. Uh, I picked this up at the buy right in Jersey City. Because literally the only singles you could get down there are bottles that they put on the, their bottle rack. I'm pretty sure I had this before. I do like this beer. Um, but like I said, buy right. You need to up your game on the singles because I can't make videos without singles. <laughs> Cheers, you silly bastards. It smells really good. I can smell citrus. Yeah, it's good. It's clean. It's refreshing. I mean, it's um, it's literally just a simple IPA. It's not overly hoppy. <clears throat> it's just like just I, uh, in my opinion, it would just be right at that point of where, you would, I guess you would you would get into like the IPAs. Like this is this might be a good jumping off point for anybody who's never had an IPA. This would be something that you can actually try, and you would actually see if you want to actually venture into the whole land of IPAs, which is it's vast. Is everybody makes IPAs? Is 15 billion different versions of IPAs, New England IPAs, West Coast IPAs, apparently New Jersey style IPAs. <laughs> but yeah, um, if you want to get into IPAs, I, I, would, I would actually suggest picking this one up, trying it, um, and you'd actually see if you really want to get Because like I said, it's not overly hoppy. It's not, um, I guess the bitter factor would be for some people, it's not, it's not bitter at all. So it's actually very enjoyable. This is, this would actually be a pretty good summertime beer. So I would add it to that summertime barbecue, uh, the barbecue beer list. So yeah, well, with all out of the way, it's gonna time. It's time to conclude this episode of Harder Bear Rams. And always remember, all beer is good beer. Cheers. <laughs>